I got a Dodger signed World Series baseball. All right. And you got a certificate of authenticity here? Yes. Let me take a look at it real quick. Official Rawlings National League baseball signed in ballpoint by 15 members of the Brooklyn Dodgers. Signers are Sandy Koufax, Elmer Vo. Elmer Vla? I didn't know he played with the Dodgers. I am not going to try to pronounce his last name. And remember, man, this is 1959, a little before my time. So <laughs> <laughs> I'm here to sell my 59 World Series signed Dodgers baseball. There's 15 signatures on the ball. I have Sandy Koufax, Don Drysdale, Don Newcomb, all Hall of Famers. So how long have you had it? Um, I'd say about 14, 15 years. OK. Um, right off the bat, Sandy Koufax in the sweet spot. That's awesome. <laughs> Right. The guy was a really good pitcher. I mean, he was the youngest person ever elected into the Hall of Fame. You know, uh, at the time, you know, him being Jewish and everything else, I mean, it, there's a lot of people that just didn't like him because of it. I mean, I think it was in the 1961 World Series, he refused to pitch on the first game because it fell on Yom Kippur, which really pissed some people off and, you know, got a lot of attention over it. So what are you looking to do with it? Uh, sell it. What are you looking to get? Uh, I'd like to get 3500 OK, um, got some questions with the ball. Uh, the signatures are in ballpoint pen. That's a, it's a kind of a big red flag there. Those weren't really around yet. <laughs> OK, so a sign when maybe they had a get together years they had later. Like a reunion or something, maybe? Or Now, I did hear they had a couple reunions, so it very well could have been done at a reunion. OK. Um, I just want to find out more about the ball. So let me, uh, let me have a buddy of mine come down and take a look at it. What are your concerns? You know, the ballpoint pen always throws me off. Yeah. And when I'm dealing with signatures, I just rather call you. <laughs> <laughs> OK. The first guy I want to look at is Sandy Koufax. I mean, he's the main guy for those Dodger teams. He kind of rolled off his letters, as you could see here. He had a great way of finishing it off with his X that kind of dropped down. Um, the next guy I'd like to look at, and that's the great Don Drysdale. The great thing about Drysdale, I always look for it, pinpoint to one thing, is he dropped his S down in his last name. And I keep looking at that, and I look at those two things. So what do you think? You know, after seeing the players I just pulled up here, um, there's no question the signatures are authentic. OK. Great. Great. OK, the next thing I want to do, I start looking at the players, Don Newcomb, Rube Walker. Uh, there's Ed Roebuck on the bottom, and Ken Lehman. That's kind of odd. Now, that's, that's one signature I have to pause at. But Ken Lehman was a guy that wasn't part of that 59 team. It's not a 59 World Series ball. If I had to guess, probably like a 57 ball. And unfortunately, they didn't win a World Series. OK. Value-wise, what are we looking at? Um, I'd put the value of this ball right around $450. Um, I'd say 250 I'm thinking I'll give you 250 bucks. Uh, no, no, that, uh, 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 no. <laughs> I mean, no. You, you know where I'm at with it, buddy. Where, where, I mean, are we even going to make a deal, or are we just wasting each other's time? You're, you asked me for 3,000. I'm, I'm telling you 250. Yeah. I mean, let's. Uh, no, um, it's still a $750 baseball to me. $750 baseball to you? Yeah. That's not to me, my man. I appreciate you coming down, though. Next All right. time. All right, thanks. With the ball now uh, still in my possession, I'm probably definitely going to hold on to it, because I know it's going to just go up in value. So it's, it's a great ball to have. I'll keep it.